That was a weird transition. Hey guys, welcome back to iPixel Sky Block three minutes late. Okay, so I had a little uh, emergency happen right before the stream started. It was kind of gross though, so I'm not gonna describe what happened. Anyway, <laughs> hello. <laughs> Literally, I, this happened like two minutes before I was supposed to start the stream, and I'm like, are you freaking kidding me? So, had to run upstairs and take care of that. Anyway, we're back. So, in the last stream, we um we did some grinding i got two and a half skill points not as much as i would have liked but today hopefully we're gonna make up for that and get like four or five so to start off we're gonna need to get some <laughs> skill xp boost potions i only have foraging at the moment <clears throat> so we're gonna start with that just like yesterday so our goal today is to get foraging up to 26 which might be a challenge, but now I know better that I can actually mine dark oak to get more XP more quickly because there's just more logs. Uh, but there's another person here. They're taking all my trees. I need to find a good lobby first. This is not this is not ideal. Yeah, we got to get our XP as high as possible this weekend. I want average skill level 30. That's another flex. So far, I have like five or six different flexes. <clears throat> Full maxed out superior and 50 mil Midas is one flex. Having 24 minion slots is another. Every single talisman in the game. Now I want average level 30 in all my skills. That'd be beautiful. Then I can consider myself the ultimate Skyblock tryhard. And that's without any level 50 skills. If I wanted to, I could just spend a ton of money on alchemy and then, you know, easily get to average level 30. But I'm doing the grind. I'm doing the stuff you can't just buy. Like farming and uh, foraging. Are you planning on grinding gas for combat? No. Pearl spamming is better, I'm pretty sure. Well, actually, no. Revs are better nowadays. <clears throat> I think revs are the best way to get combat XP in the game right now. So I might grind a bunch of revs. Which would be convenient because then it gives me the chance for a scythe blade. Which I could sell for good money. Or just keep to craft one for another flex. I don't know. Also... During the stream, we're going to be doing enough sugarcane farming until we get to like 10 or 11 enchanted sugar, probably 11. And then um, <clears throat> once we do that, then we should, um, I should be able to get my alchemy up one level, according to the math from stream chat yesterday. They said 10, but I want to be safe and get 11. Anyway, uh, once we do that, then I guess I'll do pumpkins again. And then that'll be three skill levels leveled up. So we need 600k um, foraging XP to get to the next level of foraging. I think I have enough skill XP boost potions to get me there. I have one more after this. Hopefully it doesn't take that long because that's a long time to have potions on. I want someone to test having a full ender set, right? Hot Potato Booked, Tier 6 Enchantments, but then on top of that, you get a freaking Blaze Pet. Doubles your Hot Potato Books. So you get quadruple Hot Potato Books from Ender Set. That'd be ridiculous. That's like 160 health per piece. Probably, yeah. And like 80 defense per piece on top of whatever damage bonus you get from like Godly. Like, damn, that's insane. That might actually be good. Like, I want someone to test that. That could be really, really good. How many streams or episodes where the content do you think the dungeons update is gonna give you? That is a great question. If it's at least like 30 episodes where the content, I'm happy. I don't know if that's possible for a single update to give 30 episodes worth of content. I don't know. That is yet to be seen. If I had to guess, though, it's probably more along the lines of 20 episodes of content. So in other words, after a month, I'm going to be fresh out of content again. That's my guess. Maybe not, though. They did say infinite content, but that content may not be something that is fun to watch on YouTube after 100 episodes of it, you know? It would be impressive if it was, though. Oh, 
Oh, we're close. Only 6,000 more XP. But then remember, chat, I'm only stopping once the potion runs out. So after that, we're going to keep going a little bit. Because I bet tomorrow we're going to do another level. We're going to get to 27. Imagine going from 24 to 27 in a skill in a weekend. That's ridiculous. And that's alongside other skills, too. I want to get my average skill level up to 30. It's going to happen. Hey, there it is. Forging 26. Hey. Oh, the skill XP boost potion finally ran out. There we go. We're done. That's it for foraging. We did it, chat. Woo! We're done. Oh my god, that's a lot of wood. That's almost two whole rows. Ugh. There we go. We did it, chat. After three hours of streaming, one and a third friggin' foraging levels. All right, let's do some pumpkins. Yes. Oh, how much of your money is contraband? All of it. <laughs> I'm still in debt right now. I'm going to have to get more coins to make up for it. Luckily, if I don't be stupid this time, I can actually sell my pumpkins for a good amount of money. I just got to not set the price to be half what it's supposed to be like an idiot. Probably less than half. I wasted a ton of money yesterday selling my pumpkins for like 300 coins. It is so like per enchanted pumpkin. I'm dumb. I wasted a lot of money doing that. So this time we're going to be smart and actually read the numbers that I'm typing before I press confirm. I fished for 10 hours yesterday because of the booster. How much XP did you get? A full level. So I'm 26 now in fishing. Just one level. I, yeah, ah. one level plus 200k. Yeah. Fishing sucks. Oh, yeah, it's difficult. <laughs> it's clay minions task. is like the only way at this point. They have full tier 11 clay minions with fly swatters and everything. Like the whole true bank. You have, you have fly swatters. Aren't those like oh, yeah, 20, I have 20 mil? Yeah. 20 mil each. They're 20 right? mil each. <laughs> yeah, I have 24 of them. I thought it was just <laughs> techno and squid. Oh my god. Nah, there's also Aiken. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. I'm planning to get 24 more. <laughs> I want double. Oh, they're so good for XP. Yeah, it's 20 percent more uh, stuff, right? Two more yeah. drops. Yeah. Yeah, I just woke up right now. Seven, seven and a half hours got me two stacks of clay on each. I need to get my fishing up. That's going to be my lowest scale once I fix enchanting, which is at 21 right now. Very low. Yeah, enchanting. Yeah, I think it's time to level up enchanting. A 20% booster. Yeah, I'm going to so replace good. all my minions with um, lapis. Oh, by the way, I tested fish minion against clay minion. Fish minion gives three times more XP. Well, 33% more XP, so not three times actually, but Ooh. one third. That's pretty good. So, yeah. Yeah, but yeah, you need like... But catalyst. they're super expensive. Yeah, and they're extremely expensive. But I mean, you're a YouTuber, so technically you could borrow minions, place them down and give them back, question mark. Nah, <laughs> that, that seems to be a little much. Ooh. If I did decide to go that route, though, I could generate enough fish to get a whale pet. Mm. What happened to your profile cookie? Uh, since it's a co it's a co-op now. <laughs> oh. uh, what? Why did you say rip to it? What happened? Well, it, see, now it always said like solo profile. Now it's a co-op. Wait, you invite some? Oh, I'm so dumb. <laughs> You're so <laughs> stupid. It's because I'm not gonna play on it, so I forgot. <laughs> Dude, okay, so <laughs> wait, you're the one you, like, that joined and you were asking yeah. to join. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> nice. So when when you make a co-op, I didn't know like what happens to the money. I went to go take money out of the bank and it said 30k, bro. And I I was like, no way Aiken just did me like that, dog. There's no way. <laughs> and, and it says collect solo. Fun. Yeah, it says collect solo money. <laughs> I was That's like, really I, I was funny. pooping myself, dude. You were probably like, no way. Did I that, literally dude. was about to quit, dude. I was about to quit. Imagine. <laughs> just imagine. I wake up to you like spamming my DMs. <laughs> I've just oh, made it to the halfway point. It's about 100,000 XP per layer of pumpkins. Is it really? Yep. <sighs> with the pet, right? With the pet, Matt, mm -hmm. or with the pet, the event and the uh, farming XP boost. Jesus, that's one layer, 100k. 
Yeah, I have four layers though, so I'm getting 400k and XP in an hour. And that's isn't it just endless farming because it regrows by the time you're done? Nah, mine doesn't have water, so I would have to do uh, um I would have to do a does. layer of sugar cane. Hey guys, I'm back for another stream, and welcome to High Pixel Skyblock. And uh, in the last two streams, we worked on leveling skills, and today's the final skill working stream. And I guess today's goal is to get let's see a mining level a farming level and then as many enchanting levels as we can before seven hours from now midnight so the gold minions are gone because right now we are focusing on lapis so that we can um oh there's a bunch of things that happen but anyway the lapis is meant for farm or uh mining xp as well as collecting enough lapis to make bottles for enchanting levels yes but anyway, let's get started. Oh, and before I get started, actually, off camera, I did some grinding for eyes. We have seven of them. I got them offline. I'm going to sell them now. Actually, should I sell them now? Yeah. So another thing that happened is yesterday, last night, I spent contraband on a video to make something really stupid, which I technically won't own. It's going in the contraband chests. But I did an experiment. As you can see, I no longer have 100 mil. I spent like 70 mil coins on something really stupid. But it's really cool. So, um, that's a thing. And this is another 4.5 mil. That's actually mine. I'm going to have to do the calculator thing to figure out how much I spent during the video. Like, exactly. I'm going to analyze every purchase I made. So, add it up. But anyways, the contraband count is kind of in question right now because I spent a lot. But anyway, the theory was what would happen if you maxed out an ender set with hot potato books, tier six enchantments. And then on top of that, you added a blaze pet. So that video is coming soon. I already did the recording uh, yesterday. I actually already borrowed the blaze pet to do the experiment. Also, I'm borrowing a guardian pet for once we get to the enchanting portion of the stream so we're just going to keep that in there for now i'm going to give that back to brandon after the stream uh, brandon crafter is loaning it to me you spent 59 million seven hundred and forty three thousand eight hundred ninety two coins i've already calculated it i also leashed a couple dragons made some enchantment books using my own coins but i'm not gonna I'm not gonna refund my own coins for enchantment books all right so let's put the ender set away <laughs> I cannot wait to release that video. By the time the episode that makes this VOD comes out, it probably will already be a video on my channel. Uh, anyway, let's see. I think it's time to get started uh, with collecting lapis. So let's get our silverfish pet out. And then we're going to... Well, actually, no, not silverfish. First, parrot. Then we're going to grab mining XP boost 3. And that's how we're starting the stream. Then we're going to do foraging levels as well. Lapis minions are pretty fast. Also, I upgraded all of them to tier 5. Tier 7 is a little expensive. I got some of them there, but I don't know if it's going to be worth it in the long run, so we'll see. Uh, anyway, there's all of our lapis that we've obtained over this process. You should use mushroom armor instead of ender because the stats are tripled instead of doubled at night. Well, hmm. That is true, actually. It is tripled. And that's everywhere, not just in the end. Hmm. Might need to do a part 2 to my video. Maybe later. Thank you for the super chat. Hey man, what are the most profitable minions right now? Well, the problem is if I officially recommend a minion, it won't be profitable anymore. So you're gonna have to do that research on your own. I'm sorry. If you want something safe, Clay will get you 1.4 million coins a day if you have 23 slots. So that's very good. And you sell directly to the NPC, so it actually doesn't fluctuate. It's very consistent. I might just go back to Clay because I want fishing XP, <laughs> but we'll see. But yeah, once we get all this, then I guess we're going to, um, we're going to see how much enchanting I can get done. Well, the thing is, I do have a mining XP boost three for another, I think that's an hour and 40 minutes. I think we should probably take advantage of that. Maybe do the cobble grinder for a little bit. We do need to take full advantage of these XP boost potions. 